there anything you'd like to ask me? Immortals are a new form of life, that much is certain. After the moon fell, an unknown phenomenon caused some AIs to regard humanity as a threat that must be annihilated. These immortals have their own unique language, as well as individual personalities. They can also corrupt other AIs and human weapon systems, assimilating them into their ranks to bolster their forces. Working alongside the consortiums, our goal at Orbital is to control all areas in the Oval Link. Missions to eliminate immortals are assigned to mercenaries like you to achieve that goal. Mission briefing. Briefing will now commence. This mission is a request from Sky Union. In response to the appearance of Gigant class immortals during the previous mission, Sky Union has deemed it necessary to investigate neutral areas to prevent future immortal invasions. I've uploaded a map of the mission area. The area you'll be investigating shares a border with Sky Union's territory. Complete any necessary preparations, then stand by and await dispatch. Briefing over. Gigant class immortals. So named after the mythological race. Colossal beings born from the blood that fell when the primordial god Uranus was castrated. One could say that in this gigantomachy of our time, we are like unto Zeus, brandishing his mighty thunderbolt. Real wordsmith, this guy. Say, I heard you were the first to face off against one of these. What was it like? Ah, excellent. We don't need to restrain ourselves against powerful foes, but bring to bear the full force of our absolute justice. Hmm. Well, yeah, but we still need to investigate. Better than being completely in the dark, that's for sure. In any event, it is essential that every last immortal be driven out. They are a blight, to be purged by humanity. Uh, can I ask a question? Go ahead. Oh, you're that straight shooter from Innocence. Have you been here the whole time? I have. I'm actually responsible for gathering information for our team. Please ask your question. Yes, right. The information we have on those Gigant-class immortals indicates that conventional weapons are ineffective. So what do we do if we encounter one? In the previous encounter, the area's wide-range radar and communications tower were destroyed. We gathered what little information we could from the battle data of the Arsenal combatants. Beyond that, we know little else. Since Bulletworks was responsible for their destruction in the last encounter, it is highly unlikely that a similar type of immortal could be hiding nearby. Highly unlikely, but not impossible either. Precisely, which is why Sky Union is loaning special weapons to those who accept this mission. Testing those weapons is a secondary purpose of the mission. Ah, a secondary purpose. I see. So there's a chance these untested weapons might work, but they're just loaning them to us? Yeah, I'm gonna need more incentive than that, especially when there's a chance these weapons are total duds. Whoa, we just gotta assume all the risk and that's that? They can't sweeten the deal at all? Come on, work with me here. I'll see what I can do. One moment, please. Holding out for a greater reward. You disappoint me, hero. Your older brother would never engage in such unbecoming conduct. Okay, I admit it. Dev is more of a hero than I am. He's all about getting up close and using his own power to take down enemies. But me? Well, if someone's gonna give me a powerful new weapon to play with, I am not gonna say no to that. Impressive. Yes. As mercenaries, we answer to a higher calling. One that demands we destroy the immortals by any and all means at our disposal. Such is our burden as agents of justice. I imagine being rich enough to afford a made-to-order arsenal helps to ease that burden, though. 
My siblings and I, we have to work hard so we can afford to eat. It'd really help if you sat this one out, Savior. What do you say? I wish you good luck. If you fight as a stalwart agent of justice, I will not need to enter the fray. That, in turn, would entitle you to my share of the reward. Deal. I'll do my part. I have completed negotiations with Sky Union. They are willing to extend the loan period indefinitely if you agree to provide them with all future battle data. Well, in that case, I accept this mission. What about you, Prince? When duty beckons, ours is not to refuse. Innocence will also accept. Scanning battlefield. Femto particle density is uneven, but short-range radar will not be effective. Initiating each arsenal's data link. Openings... Move out. Don't let them swarm you. They're weak one-on-one, -on -one, but in a group, they're a real pain to deal with. Rookie, try using those missiles of yours. The displayed number is you're locked on targets. You can fire more missiles with each target you acquire. So you're the little rookie I've been hearing about. <laughs> you look more broken in than I expected. Name's Deva of the Steel Knights. What's up? Oh, knock it off. I met the rookie at the briefing. Prince and no-nonsense notes are off handling another area. Don't worry, rookie. I'm sure you'll team up with them eventually. Prince? That tool savior's still alive? One of these days, I really need to knock him off that high horse of his. If you did, I doubt he'd notice. Barely remembers we even exist. Truth. Oh, whoops. We gotta make sure to keep the rookie here in the loop. Now, we mercenaries usually form groups to do this work. Collectively, we're known as reclaimers. As a group, it's easier to take on bigger missions and negotiate for whatever supplies we have. If you don't want to die, surrounding yourself with allies is the way to go. You teamed up with Bullet Works before, yeah? Among reclaimers, they're one of the larger groups. All former military types, experts in the art of war. We're talking the best of the best of the best among Reclaimers, no question. And that Prince guy? He actually leads a group of Reclaimers called the Five Hells. And that crew is something else, <laughs> that's for sure. They're nobles, basically. They got the credits and clouds to put average Joes like us to work for. That's one way of putting it. Still, even nobles have duties they can't shirk by paying off the masses. Well, whatever. We're all mercenaries in the Oval Link. And, as much as I hate to admit it, that guy's a good mercenary. Damn good either. I bet you give him a run for his money to fight. You're no slouch either. Don't forget why we're the Steel Knights. Obviously. Me and my little brother Zoa are the only reclaimers of the Steel Knights. A two-man group like ours might seem odd, but that's just how we like to roll. The best way to learn about the more famous reclaimers is to check them out for yourself. Some of them are crazy. Just absolute nutcases who dive into this mess without even blinking. It's a real freak show, that's for sure. Anyway, all Reclaimers receive missions from Orbital and the Consortiums. We complete those missions and get paid. That's all there is to it. But we all got our own reasons for doing this. Just check us all out. Like Zoa said, draw your own opinions. At the end of the day, we're all just mercenaries. I need to survive. Now let's get to work. About time. If you find any big boys, let us know. Later, rookie. You're not strong enough to handle me. Bye-bye. Sufficient weapon data collected. Mission accomplishment recognized. Executing automatic return sequence. Return according to instructions. Guess we didn't find any big boy.